gonna put the gopher back up. Yep. Okay. I miss my gopher. Your gopher. My gop, 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 gop. Welcome to the first episode of Marine Mondays, the show where we talk about a new animal each week. This week we're discussing gopher eels. They are horrible and they are very disgusting. So I thought we'd start off with something fun, like a gopher eel rather than a dolphin or a fish, because it's more interesting. So gopher eels range between 500 and 6,000 feet. So they're in the midnight zone of the ocean, which means they don't really get a lot of light. And because of this, they have really tiny, tiny, tiny eyes. Well, the midnight zones where all the animals are that have really weird, like, features. So they've, they've got that, the, there's that one with the see-through head, and you can just see its eyes. There's the anglerfish that has the little light on it. The midnight zones where all the, the weird and wonderful fishies are that nobody really wants to see. And the gulper eel is one of them. Why is it that? I don't know, I just decided one day. It evolved, but I don't know where it got there. Oh. I don't know. I'm gonna go ask one. Why are you here? Go. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. But because they're in the midnight zone, like I said, they have really tiny eyes because they live in the dark, so they want to put their energy elsewhere in the evolution. And then, yeah, they rely on their smell more rather than having to see things because there's no light there but because they have such a big mouth they're often referred to pelican eels because of the structure is built this sort of the same way as a pelican so they can be often mistaken for a pelican eel but that's just like a little nickname for them they're actually like a gulper eel um but yeah in spite of having like a large mouth they only actually eat small crustaceans, so little small crabs that might be just floating around really. They don't really have the capacity to digest larger prey. They also aren't great swimmers because their body is quite small in comparison to its mouth, so most of its energy goes into making the mouth when they grow up and things like that. And they have really tiny flippers, so they're really bad swimmers, so most of the time they just glide around and having their mouth open so anything that goes in gets eaten they're not really good at chasing prey um not much is really known about them other than they're actually disgusting and really bad looking fish (laughs) but there's not much known about how they reproduce because obviously they live in the midnight zone it's quite inaccessible unless you've got the technology and the equipment to go there Um, and they're quite elusive as well so don't know how many there are in the wild they're found everywhere in the world as long as it's you know deep enough for them to live in but it's speculated that they die shortly after reproducing but it's not really confirmed or denied it's just speculation but that's really it about gulper eels very short and sweet but yeah that's really the first episode of Marine Mondays. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do next week, but I might do an angler fish or I might do a double barrel eyed fish because they're entertaining as well and disgusting too. But I'll leave some links in the description of <laughs> good websites that have more information on gulper eels and some videos where you can see how gross they are. So. That's it for me this week. Bye-bye. Please cut the cameras.